YouTube this is Ronnie and today I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to bypass um, an account with uh, that's locked with a password or something like this here um, this trick only works with Windows XP so you know if you got the newer stuff it's like harder to do the same method will not work so <clears throat> let's get started so, as you see here, um, I currently need to enter a password. And what if I forgot the password? So, it's what you do. And by the way, there's no installed programs or anything that's um, that I'm using to do this method. This is all just an in-system um, type method. So let's get started. Turn off your computer. Okay. So I want you to turn on your computer again, but immediately start pressing the F8 key. Just keep pressing it. Okay. So, as you see here, we have advanced options. Now, any one of those three will work. The quickest method is safe mode with command prompt. Press enter and enter. Now if you see this, this is perfectly normal, so don't freak out if you see this. Um, This computer is taking a little bit of time, but that's okay. There we go. Um, and this is also perfectly normal, so don't freak out. This is just a safe mode starting up. It says safe mode here and safe mode here. And if you notice, letters are bigger than what they normally appear. That's also perfectly normal. So don't freak out. Okay. So. Um, now, what you see here is you have the account here that normally has a password. Don't click on this. Um, your administrator account, you should be able to just click. And you don't really have to enter a password. So. Um, okay, now this is going to take some command prompts to be used, um, this is what you have to enter specific command, so net space user, and you enter that right there, and then you press enter. And this will show you your accounts. Um, as you can see here, you have your administrator account that says just administrator. Um, and then you have the account that has the password. I know this has a different name than what you saw at the beginning. That's because um, something changed and I gotta fix it, but you should see pretty much your username. Um, so once you see your, once you find your username, you're gonna press net or type in net user space 
for net space user actually I'll go back okay type actually type in space so you're right here and then type in the name of the account that you want to change the password then put, put a little um, star after you press space and then put star press enter it says type a password this is where you modify the password now all I'm going to type is just one two three and four now you will notice that it doesn't show that you typed anything don't panic this is a security purpose from Windows XP it's supposed to trick I guess either you or anyone that might be watching See if I press enter retype the password one uh, I must have one two three four press enter the command completed successfully um, okay so I'm just going to turn off the computer and then turn it back on by the way that I, the way that I'm turn off the computer I don't recommend to you guys um, I'm just holding down the power thing um, I don't recommend you got anyone out there who's watching this video I don't recommend you doing it because it could corrupt your data and stuff which could it means pretty much mess up your memory and stuff so yeah So as you start up Windows XP, don't press the F8 key, don't press anything. Just let it start up as normal. And, okay. So, um, for the password, I will type in 1, 2, 3, 4. I'll press enter and bingo and your computer starts up there you go guys thank you guys for watching if you find this video helpful please like and thanks for watching again